What's up guys, it's Sydney and this is your 50 minute full body hip boot camp workout. So grab your dumbbells and let's get started. What's up guys, I'm so excited that you're here today for our 50 minute full body hip boot camp. I'm so excited to get into this. You guys know I love boot camp style workouts, so we're gonna be working for 30 seconds, resting for 15, three rounds through two exercises, okay? So we'll go one, two, one, two, one, two. And in that rest period, you can watch me demo the next move or you can stay moving with a little cardio, okay? So heart rate's gonna be up and we're gonna challenge our strength today. Speaking of strength, we've got dumbbells in the mix. I'm using 10s, 15s, and 20 pound dumbbells. Pick something that you can do in the Romanian deadlift range. So we're gonna do Romanian deadlift pulses. Those will probably be your heavier weights. And then also we're gonna be doing some plank rows. So those will probably be in the lighter end of the weight. So pick a couple options for yourself that fit you best. Also make sure you have water and a sweat towel. And before you head out today, don't forget to check out the Sydney Squad. We are rocking in this month of June together and I would love to help you out outside of these workouts with your nutrition. Okay? Let's get started with big backwards arm circles in three, two, one, here we go. And side step as well. Good, big open chest. There we go. Two, one, bring your hands back to the middle, open, cross. A little quicker with the toes, good. Five, four, two, one. All right, forwards. Now let's march those feet. Just roll up on your toes. We've got a calf raise in our first move. Okay, so get your feet warmed up. Good. Three, two, one. Take your legs out nice and wide. Let's bend and touch in front of the opposite hand as you open it up. Okay, so bend and open, bend and open. Make sure you're sitting back into your heel on this bent leg side. Good job, you'll feel this in your inner thigh. We're also stretching the core a little bit. Your arms are opening your chest up. One more each side. And good, come back into the middle, place your hands down. Bring your feet in just a little closer. I want you to drop your butt down and then lift it back up. Okay, go ahead. As you drop your butt, lift your hands and then lift it up again. Good, think about opening your hips, keeping your knees out at the bottom. And you wanna stay on the outer edges of your foot. Good, one more deep squat. Put your hands down, lift your hips up high as you push them back. Three, two, one, and roll it up. All right, let's step forward with the left foot. Okay, back toe is on the ground. You're gonna open, open, okay? Big open across your chest. Good, two more, one, and two, bring the feet back together and let's switch legs. Okay, so you're opening away. Awesome job. Three, two, one. All right, you guys can jog in place. I'm gonna show you your first two exercises, okay? So get a jog started for me. There we go. Your first move is a squat and a half with a calf raise. So from the side, squat, half, and then calf raise at the top, okay? So grab your weights, go ahead and join me for 30 seconds, two, one, let's go. Squat, halfway, squat, calf raise. You can hold your dumbbells here at your chest to keep your chest up nice and high. 10 more seconds. Two, one, place your dumbbells down. You can jog in place. Your next move I'll show you and we'll start in 10 seconds. Shoulder tap, push up. So tap, tap, 
one push up. Okay, if you need to modify, go to your knees. Let's go together in two, one, here we go. Tap, tap, push up. 30 seconds right here. Keep your abs tight, legs tight. Good job, 15 more seconds. Lots of core involved here as well, right? Four, three, two, one, rest. All right, we're back to exercise one. 15 seconds, you can jog in your rest or you can switch your dumbbells out, grab some water. All right, we're going again in five seconds. Here we go, three, two, one, let's go. Squat, halfway, squat, calf raise. Lift those heels at the top. Good job, keep breathing. You've got 10 seconds. Awesome, three, two, one, rest. All right, dumbbells down. Round two, shoulder tap push up. Jog in the middle. All right, five seconds, come on down. Here we go, two, one, let's get it. Drop to the knees if you need to. If you are on your knees, make sure your butt goes down with your chest. Don't leave it in the air like this. Pull it down and let's go. 10 more seconds. Beautiful, three, two, one. Okay, last round of both of them. Jog in place if you would like or grab water. Here we go. Three, two, and let's get it. Good job. To modify, you can also just drop the dumbbells, drop your weight down. Give you a little tip on the calf raise. Squeeze your glutes as well so you can stay balanced. Eight seconds. And rest, good. Throw those dumbbells up. In 15 seconds, we've got our last round. Shoulder tap, push-ups, okay? Come on down. Whew, we've got 30 seconds rest after this. Two, one, all right, let's go. Stay on your toes. If you're working hard on that, stay with me, you can do it. 15 more seconds, I know you can. There we go. Push, 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 push. Seven. Come on, three, two, one, rest. You've got 30 seconds rest. I'm gonna show you your next move. Okay, so these leg exercises on this one will be a little quicker. So dumbbells are up at your chest again. We're gonna go lunges. You pick forward lunges here or reverse lunges here, whichever is most comfortable to you, okay? We're gonna go down reverse lunge and staying low and quick, okay? So that's your first one. Let's go together. Two, one, here we go. Stay low, drop the knee and switch quickly. Good, try to keep that knee nice and low. 10, nine, that's it, five, three, two, one. Drop the light dumbbells down and grab one of your heavier dumbbells, okay? You can bring it down to this end. We've got two rows per arm, okay? So we're going one, two, switch it over. Ready? Let's go. And 
And you can rest your other hand on your knee if you would like. Just keep that back nice and flat. 15 seconds, 10 seconds, four, three, two, one, rest. All right, back to our quick low lunges. Again, these are meant to be quick, so if you need to go body weight, you can. Whew. Here we go, four, three, grab those dumbbells, two, one, let's go. Stay low. You don't have to touch your knee on the floor, but if you can, go for it. Keep your core tight the entire 30 seconds. Okay, you've got 10 seconds left right now. Chest up, abs tight. Bend that back knee, two, one, rest. All right, let's jog in place. Whew. Doing okay? Good, I'm proud of you. Seven seconds, two rows per arm, ready? Two, one, all right, let's go. Remember, flat back, you're drawing that dumbbell back here so your arm is pulling back and not just bringing it up under your armpit. Good job, seven seconds. Two, one, all right. Last round of both, 10 seconds and we'll go together. Okay, back to the lunges. Here we go. Three, two, one, let's get it. And when you come up to switch feet, dig your heel into the ground. So you're really relying on your glutes here. Glutes and quads. Almost there. Seven, six, two, one. Rest, good job. Dumbbells up over here. Last round with the two rows. Then we've got 30 seconds rest. Six seconds, five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Think about your shoulder blade. Close your eyes if you need to. And just envision your shoulder blade moving over towards your spine with each rep. Keep your head neutral. Looking down at the floor. Nine, eight, that's it, five, four, two, one, rest. All right, 30 seconds rest. I'm gonna leave this one heavy dumbbell over here on the side, grab some water. All right, Whew. here we go, 15 seconds. Your first move is gonna be a sumo squat and you're pushing off to the side when you come up. Okay, so sumo squat, push to the side and lift side and lift, okay? Join me in three, two, one, let's go. Sumo, lift, right down, lift. Keep your toe flexed up towards your knee and let your heel be the highest point on that lift. If this isn't heavy enough for you, grab your other dumbbell. Good job, seven. Six, three, two, one, rest, good. Now grab your lighter dumbbells again, front to side raise, and then we're going side to front raise. Okay, so you open it up in the front, down to the side, and you bring it up to the side, back down to the front, ready? Let's go, arms are a little bit bent, Get to the positions at each side and then go down, okay? Ten seconds. Three, two, one, rest. Good.
Good job. Okay, jog in place. We're back to your sumo squat, side raise. All right, five seconds, grab your dumbbell. Here we go, three, two, one. Let's go, sumo, lift the heel. And try to make it fluid. As you come up, shift your weight and lift your heel at the same time. Squeeze that glute at the top. You'll feel the difference if you slow it down, squeeze, versus if you just squat and lift, okay? Seven, six, five, three, two, one. Rest, good. All right, coming back, front to side raise. All right, here we go. Five seconds, jog if you can. Three, two, one. All right, let's go. Good job. Up, out, down. You're doing great, come on. 15, 14. Perfect. Woo, seven, six, five. Two, one, rest, and we're back over. Last round. You guys doing all right? Whew. All right. Sumo squat, jog in place if you need to. Four, three, two, one, let's go. Sumo, drive the heel. Sit, sumo, and heel. Squeeze at the top. Good job, nine, eight, that's it. We're almost done with these two. Work with me, five, four, two, one, rest. You can throw that dumbbell up or jog in place. Last one right over here, 10 seconds. Whew. Here we go, five, three, two, one. Let's go, front raise to the side and then down. Side, front, and down. And make sure if you look at me really quick, don't go past your shoulders. Here, you're dropping right before you get to the shoulders. Okay, so don't go behind your body. 15 seconds. That's it, four, three, two, one. Beautiful job. You've got 30 seconds rest, guys. You're doing great. Whew. Grab some water, okay? All right, now come on down. I want you to double your mat up and grab one of your heaviest dumbbells. Okay, what we're gonna do is just sit back and squeeze. All right, so dumbbells gonna stay here at your chest. Toes are flat on the mat. You're gonna sit back and then you're gonna squeeze your glutes up and forward, okay? Two, one, let's go together. Sit, squeeze. And make sure you're not totally sitting down here. Don't relax. It's all kind of a hip hinge. So think Romanian deadlift, reach, squeeze. Reach. Good job. Two, one, rest, good. Now, two lighter dumbbells. We're going for those plank rows, okay? So come up into a plank on your hands. You're gonna row left and then right. If you need to modify, hands go down. Row left and then right, okay? Let's go. Also, another modification, drop to your knees. Pull right here, okay? So lots of ways to make this your own. Don't let your hips open up. The plank aspect is crucial on this one. Your hips will move a little bit, but don't let them open all the way up. Three, two, one, rest. Good. Throw those dumbbells out of the way. And we're back up to your heavy dumbbells. Whew. Doing all right? That's it. Three, two, 
One, hips go back, and then squeeze forward. And I want you to pause up here. One, two, sit and back. Good job. Almost there, 10 more seconds as of right now. Good job. Squeeze the cheeks together. Two, one, let's go. Back to the plank rows. Now make it work for you, however you need to. If that means just one dumbbell in between your two hands and you modify this way, that's okay. If you can go all the way up in the plank, let's do it. Here we go, two, one, let's row. Hips face the floor the entire time. Whatever position you're doing. Strong core. 10 seconds. Three, two, one, rest, good job. And one more round through those two. I know there's no cardio in between these two, but repositioning kind of takes a couple seconds for this one. Okay, last round, you ready? Three, two, one. All right, let's go. Hips go back, glutes squeeze together. Good, seven seconds. Four, three, two, one, squeeze and release. Good job. All right, back to our plank rows. I want you to step it up in some way on these plank rows, okay? I'll tell you when it's halfway, so if you can step it up again, let's do it. Okay, two, one, let's go. Wide feet for me. Row and tight belly. You're doing great, good job. Come on, four, three, two, one, rest. Good job. We've got 30 seconds rest. And you can move those dumbbells out of the way, grab some water. Whew. All right, you guys doing good so far? All right, next move, we're gonna go Romanian deadlift and a half and kneeling shoulder press, okay? So heavier dumbbells here. All right, we're gonna go down Halfway, down, all the way, okay? Go ahead and join me. Two, one, let's go. So you go all the way, come halfway, squeeze the cheeks in really good, all the way back down, squeeze the cheeks to stand all the way up. Good job, eight, seven, Two, one, rest, good job. Now drop right down to your knees. If you need to, you can double up your mat again. We're gonna go dumbbell shoulder press. All right, so take one arm at a time. You're gonna curl, press, and then switch. Ready, let's go. And I know you have your heavier dumbbells right now. That's intentional. That's why I have you doing one arm at a time. So you've kind of got a little bicep action in here. You're working your abs so that you don't let your hips scoot back and forth. Great job, come on. Five, three, two, one, rest. 15 seconds rest, and we're back up. Romanian deadlift and a half. Jog in place if you would like. Five seconds, go ahead and grab your dumbbells. Three, two, one, all right, let's go. Squeeze at each point. When you bring your hips forward, each time squeeze in, okay?
Good job. Halfway, 15 more seconds. Good, almost there. Three, two, one, rest, good. Back down to your knees. If you need to drop weight, you can, but try to go with your heavier dumbbells since we're only doing one arm at a time. Okay, and if your heaviest dumbbells aren't challenging you enough on this one, go both arms at the same time and get more reps in. Two, one, let's go. Good job, keep the glutes tight. Don't let your hips swing around. Good, you're right there, nine, eight, Seven, four, three, two, one, rest. Whew. All right, come on back up. Romanian deadlift and a half. Jog if you'd like. Good job. Five seconds. Grab your dumbbells. Here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Last round of these. Down, halfway, down, all the way. Let's go. That's it. Squeeze the glutes in. That's it. Five, four, two, one, and rest. Back down to the knees. And last round of these two. You're doing great. A little sweat in the eyeball. All good. Here we go. Shoulder press. Curl and press, two, one, let's do it. Good job, good job, come on. Come on, breathe through it, you've got six, five, Three, two, one, rest. And you've got 30 seconds rest, guys. Great job. Grab some water. Whew. Okay, just one dumbbell for your next move. All right, in 13 seconds, we're gonna go plie squat. So that means toes are pointed out, okay? You're gonna grab the dumbbell from the middle, come up, place it on your right hip, Switch, left hip, switch, right hip, switch. Ready? Let's go. Right, left. And let it sit on your leg as you kind of sit into that squat. So you've got a little shoulder action and a little squat action. Good, eight, seven, Three, two, one, rest, good job. Now we're taking that dumbbell, same one. We're going all the way from your legs to overhead. Okay, so arms are bent just a little bit. Lifting up, come down, stop before the legs and go back up. Ready, let's go. If this isn't heavy enough for you, grab two dumbbells, okay? Good work, come on, come on. Five, four, three, two, one, rest, good job. All right, we're back. Squat switches. Whew. You guys doing all right? So, already got the dumbbell up here. Let's throw it on the right hip first and sink it down. Toes out, ready? Here we go. Down, up, switch, down. Make sure this is your heavier dumbbell too. Let it sit right on that internal crease of your leg and dig the heels down. 14, 13, 11, 10, nine, Three, two, 
one. Rest, good job. See how we're kind of getting as many reps in there as we can? Okay. Whew. You're doing amazing. Back to our overhead raise. Here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Up and down. You're gonna have to squeeze that dumbbell as well. Okay, so your chest is activated a little bit. Don't move your hips. Good, 10 more seconds, here we go. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, two, one, rest. Okay, we got one more round of both. We're moving right along in this boot camp. You guys doing okay? Big deep breath. Okay, grab that dumbbell. Let's start on the left side first this time. Big wide stance. Two, one, sink it down. Down, switch. Down, switch. Good job. Down. Good job, 15. Almost there, come on. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Rest, good, good, good. Okay, leave that dumbbell right there. We're back over, front raises. Whew. A little bent arm, Whew. a little bend in the knee, pull the core in. Two, one, let's go. To avoid letting your lower back swing, squeeze your glutes in. 15 more seconds. Almost there, five, four, three, two, one, and rest, great job. Woo, all right. Throw those dumbbells back up. I want you to grab your lighter dumbbells, okay? You've got 30 seconds rest. I'm just gonna show you your next two, okay? Dumbbells overhead. As you bend for your tricep extension, lift one leg. Lift, okay? We're going in five seconds, so grab those light dumbbells. Three, come on. Two, one, bend your elbows and lift your leg. Now switch. Balance, core strength. Keep the elbows tight and keep your quad tight as well. To modify, maybe just lift your toe on one leg. Lift, okay, five seconds. Good, two, one, rest. Woo. All right, leave those there and I want you to grab your medium dumbbells. Bring it over here and we're gonna lay it down. Chest fly and glute bridge, okay? So hips are up, dumbbells are up. You're gonna open up and drop your hips and then come back up together. Ready, let's go. Open the arms, close the arms and squeeze the glutes. Great job, come on. Almost there, seven, six, five, one more, three, two, one, rest. Good job, all right. Back up, tricep extension and leg raise. And that leg raise is meant to be a very tight inner thigh move. So you're lifting kind of heel out, or heel in, okay? Two, one, let's go. Hands up, feet are down. Drop your hands and lift that heel. And switch. Good, it takes a lot of focus. So find that spot on the floor. Two, one, rest. Good job, I know it was quiet on that one. It does take some focus there. All right, back down, glute bridge, chest fly. You guys are doing great. So proud of you. Here we go. 
Hips up, dumbbells up. Two, one, let's go. Nice work, come on. 10 seconds, and we're switching back for your last round of both of them. Feel free to jog in your 15 second rest. Three, two, one, rest. Come on up. Like I said, you can jog. Just make sure about five seconds left, you grab those dumbbells, okay? Five seconds left, here we go. All right, dumbbells up. Feet are down, lift the left leg. Ready, let's go. Lift your foot right out to the front so it's going right out in front of your belly button. Good work, I know this is a unique move, but I know you can do it. Three, two, one, rest. Kind of forgot that my triceps were on fire because I was focusing on my balance. So, perks of that move. <laughs> okay, last round, come on down. All right, hips up, dumbbells up. Two, one, let's go. Fifteen seconds. That's it. Eight, seven, five, four, three, two, one. Rest. All right. Bring those dumbbells back up. Thirty seconds rest. Grab water. You guys are doing great. I'm so proud of you. Whew. Okay. Next move. Back fly and single leg kickback, okay? In 12 seconds, we'll go together. So I want you to stand upright, okay? Hinge forward, you're gonna fly and lift. If you need a break in between those, you can stand back up. Otherwise, just stay right here. Ready, let's go. Fly and lift. Just one at a time. And if you need a break, stand up, hinge, fly. Stand up, hinge, fly, okay? It's up to you. If you need that rest, take it. Almost there, four, three, two, one. Good job. Now, lighter dumbbells there. I want you to grab hammer curl weight dumbbells. You're gonna turn your toes out. Stay up in a calf raise as you do hammer curls, okay? We'll do left arm and right arm alternating. Ready? Heels up, tight abs, let's go. Good, good, good. I'm trying to recruit as many muscles as possible in each move, okay? Try to simulate that boot camp style. Keep the core and the glutes tight. Four, three, Two, one, rest, good. All right, back to the light dumbbells. You're doing fantastic, okay? Bend forward, then fly and lift. Another thing to do to modify is just separate the moves, okay? Two, one, let's go. So another modification, you can lift and then fly, okay? If you need to do that, that's okay, let's go. Good, almost there. Four, three, two, one, rest. Woo. Okay. <sighs> Big deep breath, hammer curl, calf raise. Remember, just one at a time. Toes are turned out. Lift up onto your toes. Pull the glutes and the abs in. Ready, let's go. Good job, come on. 
Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze for 15 seconds. Stay up high on those toes. Beautiful. Three, two, one. Rest, good job. Okay, come on back. Whew. Last round of both, all right? Woo. So proud of you guys, come on, we got it. Last round here, modify how you need to if you need to. Two, one, let's go. Good job, 15 seconds. Woo, eight seconds, seven, six, three, two, one, and rest. Woo. Okay, back over, hammer curls, calf raise. You're doing amazing. All right, toes are out, heels are close. Ready, lift it up, let's go. Squeeze the glutes and the abs. Seven seconds. Two, one, rest, great job. All right, 30 seconds rest, grab water. All right, single leg Romanian deadlift and tricep kickback combo. Let's break it down, okay? Elbows are gonna stay right here the entire move. So bring your elbows in here, okay? Lift one leg, kick it back. If you need to modify, take it back, kick it back. Okay, just leave it on the floor and then switch. Ready? Let's go. Like I said, if you need to modify, kick it back, just put it on the ground. Good job. Three, two, one, rest. Woo. Okay, one heavy dumbbell. Holding it right at your chest. Curtsy lunge. Okay, we're gonna two pulse at the bottom. One, two, up and switch. Ready? Let's go. Front rack right here. Dig that front heel down, down. There we go. Don't mind my grunting. It's my emphasizing you working hard. Let's go, 12, 11, six, five, three, two, one, rest. Good job. And we're back over. Deadlifts and tricep kickback. And I'm really focusing on these triceps today. I know. You got it. Lock the elbows here. Two, one, let's go. Good job, keep your belly button right over your toe. And focus. Good job, five. Two, one, rest, woo! Okay, two done of that one. Let's go back to that heavy curtsy pulse. Okay, hands right here, putting it right against your shoulders. Let's go to the right first. Two, one, let's go. One, two, up and switch. Front heel digs down. Good, you feel the difference when you really push that front heel into the floor? Eight, seven, four, three, 
two, one, rest. Whew. Come on back. Round three, deadlift, tricep kickback. And the same goes for if you need to modify here. If you need to switch up, do the deadlift, come up and then kick back, that's okay too. All right, it's your workout, okay? You're 100%, let's go. Good job, come on. Seven seconds. Two, one, rest. All right, throw those dumbbells up. 30 seconds over here, and we've made it, guys. This is it, no surprises. Promise, no burpee, tuck jump, back flips, nothing like that. Ready, let's go. Down, down, up and over. Core is tight. No one, two, up and switch. 10 seconds, come on. Four, three, one more, let's go together. Two, one, and rest. Throw that dumbbell up, and I want you to have a seat. Legs are extended out front. Whew. Big deep breath in. <sighs> Exhale. We're moving right into your cool down. So now that you're here, just stay here. Don't skip the cool down, and let's go forward, okay? Grab your ankles or your legs or your toes. Let your back round and let your head drop. Need a nice long cool down today. After that full body workout, I need you to know your body just worked very hard. We're gonna stretch it out so you feel amazing for tomorrow. Okay. Come back up for me. All right, separate your legs just a little bit. All right, same thing, down in the front. Exhale as you go forward. Take your right hand and reach over to your left foot and switch. Right to left, switch. So you're crossing over your arm, touch that opposite toe, and we're really gonna stretch your mid, lower back as well. Okay, over, back to the middle, and over. I wanna let you know how proud I am of you today. I do want you to focus on this cool down, but guys, I'm so proud of you. June is gonna be incredible. This year is gonna be incredible. All right, come back up. Lay back on your back for me. <sighs> Straighten both your legs out. I want you to bend them and grab the inside of your shins, okay? And then let your hips open up as you pull your feet into your chest. Okay, so again, grab shins, pull your feet in, let your knees open. You should feel this in your inner thigh. Release your left leg and take it flat onto the ground. Right leg goes straight and back towards your chest. Nice, long pull here. Let's cool down hamstrings, back of the legs, really good. Make sure it's right over your chest too, not off to the side. Okay, pull it right in here over your chest. Pull the other leg up top. Let's switch it over. Okay. Keep your shoulder blades flat. Pull that leg right up to your chest. Keep breathing. Let this cool down process be part of your mental gratitude practice today. Thankful for a body that got you through that workout. I'm thankful for a community that supports these workouts, that does them with me and I know not every workout is everyone's favorite, but I'm proud of you for pushing through. The only important thing in each workout that you guys need to worry about is that you're working your very hardest, okay? Come on up and flip over to your stomach. I know not everyone's workout, or not every workout is everyone's favorite, and 
That's okay, all right? Just make sure you're controlling what you can control and that you're working your hardest every single day, okay? I'm so grateful that you're here with me. Push up, push up, push up. Lift your chin if you can. Bring your chin back down, tuck it into your chest. And let's bend onto your knees. Tuck your toes down and lift your hips up and drive your heels down to the floor. Press your hands into the mat, drive those heels down. Shift right to left. Let's get a little bit deeper in each calf. Right side and left side. And nice and slow, keep your legs straight as you walk your hands back into your toes. And as the clock rolls down to zero, you can come right on up. And guys, we have made it. I'm so glad you were here with me today. Thank you for pushing me. I knew that you were gonna show up today, so I pushed myself. Envisioning us working out together is what gets me through every workout, so I am forever grateful that you're here, forever grateful that you're sharing the workout, so make sure you share this one on your Facebook, Twitter, Instagram story, all your text messages, all your business emails. No, I'm just kidding, but just make sure you share the workout. As I know it's summer, people are looking for new ways to really spice up their routines, so you might help someone, even if they don't say that you inspire them. Who knows what you can do if you share something positive, right? So take that into your day with your workouts, with your energy, with the way that you approach people. Who knows what a difference you can make if you do something positive today. So first of all, positive thought number one, tell yourself, great job. Whew, amazing job today. You gotta be proud of yourself. You gotta appreciate yourself and appreciate the body that got you through this, okay? Number two, another way to show that positive self-appreciation, make sure you're eating the foods that make you feel amazing, okay? I'm not saying this to make sure you're eating salads all day, every day. I'm saying eat the foods that make you feel and perform amazing, okay? If you need some help with that, if you're still not sure, check out the Sydney Squad in the description below. If you're in the squad, share it with a friend. And before you head out today, I wanna make sure you comment, I crushed this boot camp in the comments below so you can encourage other people and I'm so proud of you. I love you guys, and I'm always here for you. I'll see you tomorrow.